eyeshadow that I just ordered that I did I that just came in today that I ordered it's called earth um, so I've been wanting to dabble in some more neon so that is what I'm doing in this video today so if you like the way that this look came out or if you just want more you know info just go ahead and keep watching um, just go ahead and keep watching okay eyeshadow primer on my eyelids and it worked pretty good yesterday so I'm just you're gonna try it again today um, so that's what I did to prim, prime my eyes I'm gonna go ahead and start with this baby right here I cannot wait to play in this okay where did my eyeshadow brush go all right Wow, so look at that pigment that it's catching on the brush. Now I put tape on my eyes because y'all know I gotta get it together. So I was really excited to get this in the mail because I've been waiting on it for about three weeks now. But the girl, I got it on Etsy and I know that the girl, she hand makes them. So I knew it was going to take some time for it to get here. Um, but, you know, I don't mind waiting. I've been like really wanting to try like a neon uh, green. I don't know why. But I've just been really wanting to. And it's supposed to be like UV at nighttime. Like in UV light, you're supposed to like glow up. But I've just really been into some neon shades. So that's why I ordered it. Because I was like, I don't want to buy a whole neon palette. And then what if I don't like it? So I was like, I'm just going to buy the shade. And let's just see how it goes. Wow. So when I pat it on, look how pigmented this is and this is vegan and cruelty free I honestly don't even know what kind of eye look I'm finna create but I was like you gotta start somewhere You gotta start somewhere so this week i'm gonna be flooding y'all with videos because a lot of things that i've ordered are coming in this week also i'm getting a new backdrop because you know it's holiday season so i got to get in the holiday spirit but um but yeah i've got like my ipsy is supposed to be coming on friday uh so keep a lookout for that video um I got to tell you about the drama that I had with them. I will be sharing with y'all in that video. But um, getting my Ipsy Friday, I ordered some brushes that I want to review from Morphe um, this weekend as well. So I'm going to be reviewing those brushes. Like there's a lot of things that I've gotten that I'm just waiting on. So I will be flooding y'all with videos. And I hope y'all go and watch them. But anyways, today is Tuesday. Can y'all believe it's about to be Hall Halloween? Girl, you are stuck in October. Um, it's about to be freaking Thanksgiving next week. What the F? Like... It came so fast like the end of the year is gonna be tomorrow pretty much like that's how it feels with this time going by so fast oh my god I really 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 love the way that this is coming out and remember I had told you on my uh, did I let you oh, no no I don't think I showed y'all this glitter palette but I got this glitter palette that I've been waiting to use I got this at the Dollar General and I got this specifically for this eyeshadow because I want to go ahead and top the eyeshadow with this neon green glitter so and I got that at the Dollar General it was like a dollar fifty 
and it has all these pretty colors but yeah i cannot believe that it is about to be thanksgiving next week y'all know i like to eat so i will be eating <laughs> So I went ahead and I just love the way that this is going. Oh, and what I also liked about the person that I bought this shadow from, she hand makes all of her eyeshadows. Um, I will leave you the inf her information in the in, in the link down below so you can visit her. She has an Instagram page and then she has her Etsy account, but you can take a look at all of her eyeshadows. But even though um she sent me this eyeshadow she sent me a sample of another neon eyeshadow it's pink where is it omg i think i lost it or i just can't see it oh here it is so she sent me this pretty neon pink um, I want to try it out. It's also you like in the in UV light it glows So I want to try this too. I'll probably do this for another day But yeah, I like that she sent me a sample of this because if I do like it, I will be buying it um, Oh, this is her Instagram Monique bull Bully or boule underscore mua I wonder If it'll let you catch that but I'll leave her information in the link below. But yeah, she has some really good stuff. And I like trying makeup from different places. Like, I love indie brands. And I definitely support someone who, like, she she makes these on her own. So that's why it took a long time to get here. <laughs> but so far, I can say it has been worth the wait. So, like I said, I'm just kind of packing this green on on this eye. Because I want to do a dramatic look or i want to see what i can create with this look i think i'm just gonna put it all over the eye <laughs> i love it so much i'm just gonna freaking put it everywhere and then I'm just going to blend it out in a little bit, but I just want to pack in as much color as I can. So that way when I do blend it out, the color doesn't disappear on me. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and use that Dollar General brush that I told y'all about in my previous video. It actually works really good, so I'm just going to blend it out. And I'm just going to blend it out, and I'll be right back. Okay, so I went ahead and put the green on both eyes. Now I'm going to go ahead and smoke out my outer V with this black right here. And this is from Smoke and Mirrors Revolution. I'm just going to use the black right here to smoke out that outer V. And I'm using the Luxie brush, Luxie blending brush 237. So it's got like a fluffy, um, you know, it's a fluffy brush. And it's like a kind of medium skinny fluffy brush, which is perfect for hitting the inside of that crease and that V. So that's what I'm, that's all I'm doing. I'm gonna go ahead and do that to this side. I really, really love the way that this is coming out and I didn't expect it to come out like this.
So I'm gonna go ahead and just finish blending off camera just cause I don't wanna put too much time on this video. Um, but I'm literally just blending out this corner and I'm gonna keep blending it until I get the color that I want. inner V so it looks like a little neon smoky color and now I'm gonna go ahead and put this green as my topper on my eyelids so yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and do that add some lashes and hold on hold on real quick let me see if these colors are gonna work actually I'm probably gonna need like um like a dipping, I don't know. I guess I could still use, where did it go? I'm literally losing brushes and they're right in front of me and I don't see them because I don't know why. I don't know why. Okay, where is that brush that I was using? Oh, I'll, I guess I'll just go in with the same brush that I've been using to put in that, um, glitter so i'm just gonna go ahead and press the glitter on i'll be right back so this is my completed look let me know what you guys think of this i am so happy with the way that this came out like you just have no idea this it was worth the three week wait she hand makes these so girl i get it i understand they're so good they're so pretty um and they glow in the dark i wish i had like a uv light so y'all could see but um but yeah so y'all guys saw it was a really simple easy look i basically just put neon green all over my eye smoked out the outer v with black to have like a smoky neon look and then, of course, I just put some glitter on my eyelid. Y'all know I love glitter. Um, let me get back to this palette that I told you that I wanted to use for this video. This, it didn't work, so I didn't end up using it. It was just really hard to pack on the glitter. And it was really sticky, so I was like, no, I'm not going to... I didn't use that, so I'm just going to throw this away. Um, so I ended up, you remember that beauty pop-up shop that I went to a while back, um, not a while back, but recently, and I had got the She, uh, Unicorn Glitter Palette. It has nine color pressed glitter palettes, glitter shades, my bad. And, um, I absolutely love these, and I went ahead and just applied this green one down here on my eyelids. I didn't put too much glitter because I didn't want to take away from how pretty this neon look is. But yeah, that's the I ended up using this one instead. Um, I just love how this came out. It looks super cute. Guys, I know like a lot of y'all do not like to dabble in bold or bright colors. But guys, get out of your comfort zone, okay? Like, I understand you want to keep it safe. You want to keep it neutral, natural colors, warm colors, or a cool tone color. Um, but it's okay to dabble. Like, it's super, like, just, you know, colors are not always a seasonal thing. I hate when people are like, well, it's fall. Like, why are you going to use bright colors? I, uh, because colors are not a seasonal thing. You can use colors any time of the season. This is neon green, and I would rock this. I'm going to rock this tomorrow, actually. But, like, this is cute. I like it. So, I just love colors. You guys know I get super mojada for colors. Um, but, anyways, let me know what you guys think of my eye look. I just absolutely love it. But, um... I'm going to be flooding y'all with a lot of videos soon because I'm getting a lot of things that I ordered this week. Um, also, I'm getting a new backdrop because it's holiday season and I need to get in the holiday spirit. Um, and then I get my Ipsy hopefully this weekend. So keep a lookout for my Ipsy unboxing. 
Um, I am going to be reviewing some brushes that I ordered. Um, a lot of people always ask me all the time, which brushes are good? Which brushes do you use? Are they worth the money? Or which brushes are more on the affordable side that are still good quality? Um, so, you know, I will be reviewing some new brushes. Um, what else? Oh, I ordered the Huda Beauty gold obsessions palette that's exclusively to cult beauty sorry my son's in the background he needs to be quiet but anyways um it's exclusive to cult beauty and it just launched yesterday and i've been waiting for it i've been talking about it for like three weeks i ordered it it shipped so it should be getting here well i don't know it's coming from the uk so it's probably gonna take a while to get here but when it gets here i can't wait to review it for you guys because i love huda beauty and i love gold palettes i love glitter and you know her formula is bomb so i can't wait to review it mm, I'm trying to think of what else i need to tell you guys about oh my november giveaway so drum roll i'm gonna be having two giveaways in november this month uh, my regular November giveaway and then I'm gonna be giving away a separate giveaway for the Natasha Denona palette um, The peak palette that I got in my boxycharm if you guys didn't watch my boxycharm video go watch it But I got the Natasha Denona peak palette. I'm gonna go ahead and put the, I'm gonna give that away um, Because I a lot of people like that. Pal I like the palette too, Natasha Denona I mean, it's a beautiful palette. It's just I know I'm not gonna use it because I have so many palettes that kind of look like that already and I know I'm not going to use it so I'm going to just give it away uh, to one of my lucky subscribers so yeah two giveaways in November so keep I'm going to give you all some more details on my giveaways this weekend but yeah so I'm going to have two giveaways for November my regular November giveaway and then the Natasha Denona Peak Palette giveaway so you definitely want to stay tuned because you could win one of those and I know my subscriber last month she loved everything that I had in the giveaway um, this month is going to be a good month as well again if you're not subscribed to my channel go ahead and subscribe please subscribe okay um, give this video a big thumbs up go ahead and comment down below let me know if you like this look um, but yeah I'll keep you guys updated adios